uh, hi friends welcome to the second part of the front fender design and here i am going to discuss about some excellent techniques that i am using to get a smooth blending between these two segments by manipulating the control vertex cv you can say and uh, i will appreciate to watch this video till end because in the last part of this video i have used some awesome techniques uh, in katia to solve this visual problem uh, so this video is going to be more exciting and full of advanced surface modeling techniques even if you are not familiar with LES, I encourage you to continue watching this section. And also, you have the option to bypass this part. And friends, I truly miss your like and comments. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Uh, I am using some cool techniques to achieve a seamless transition between these two segments by adjusting the control vertex uh, positions. So in this way we will know exactly where to make change uh, for a smooth blending. The modifications can significantly enhance the overall quality and the visual appeal of the glassy surface. So the end result will be a really visually pleasing surface. So the required surface adjustment has been completed in LES. Now let's move to Katia.
Uh, so now I am using the join command and select one page and I'm using the distance propagation option. So in this way, Katia will join all the adjacent pages. So now I'm going to create a plan which uh, will be normal to the screen. So here, go to the equation and parallel screen click on the and click uh, point any vertex that's fine so it will create a, a plane which will be parallel to the my screen at that moment so now I'm going to create a sketch on that plane and uh, I'm using two splines very simple splines can manipulate the splines by using the vertex freestyle now come out from the sketch so now use the extrude command to extrude the surface and extrude as per requirement so now keep uh, both the elements and uh, later on we will extract and uh, just click ok and then uh, whatever is that you can skip it cancel it so now i will going to use the extract command to extract these two segments so now these are two and just hide the extrude surface and uh, now we are going to intersect um, these two segments with the extracted surface so that we will get intersecting curve now hide these elements and, uh, and now use the split command uh, to split these two segments so now we are going to create a blending between the splitted resultant surfaces uh, I have already covered these techniques in my previous tutorial so if you have not watched the first part of the front fender yet I recommend please check it out and this time I will be using the same technique again but this time with a more advanced approach so stay tuned for the updates so I think we need to create some artificial vertex but uh, but i think we don't need we already have a very good surface there so let's click on the blend command and uh, try to change the coupling option uh, tangency then curvature but i think this option will not work so just uh, the tangency option will work Uh, really this time the quality of surface has improved significantly and I'm really satisfied with this
uh, stay connected with me to expand your knowledge in advanced uh, classes surface modeling techniques and thank you so much for watching this part of this tutorial series